Hello, collective. How is my collective? Welcome. Welcome to Pam Star Oracle. I'm Pam. Nice to meet you all. I hope I can uh, give you something today on, on your journey. And I hope that uh, you'll continue to check me out sometimes. I come up with new things all the time. I appreciate each and every one of you all that comes to my channel. Uh, I'm doing something different here today for everybody to help to help gain some more clarity. This is about past life. This is a past life reading, okay? And I mean, if it rings true to you to this day, it could be of happening in your real life today or you're listening. But a lot of this, it'll say uh, like pre-Columbian Americas and stuff like that. But I'll show you what I do right here in a second. And uh, I, I welcome you. And I'm trying to get to 500. I'm trying to get over 1,000, obviously. But I need help so I can give a deck away to my collective. They've been waiting on it. And if you're new, you can give me your name. And you will be able to be entered in when I give that deck away. As soon as I hit 500. I've got a system. All I've got to do is go look through there on everybody that commented. And I have their name already. But the people that kept it a secret, well, they... They just got to write their name on one of my messages so I'll know to enter their name. You see what I'm saying? All right, now, what else? Oh, thank you for that spirit. I love spirit. Do y'all love spirit? Collective, you see how fast? Oh, wow. And uh, I'll turn it over. They got both something on it, okay? And I'll show you how I'm going to do it right here in just a second, okay? All right. Let me get a drink. <sighs> I gotta take my pen off. I gotta take my pen off to show y'all something. All right, so the way this card lays right now, what it says is accomplishment, celebrity, competitor, failure, achiever, and then on the back I'll. T I'll turn it around in a minute and see what it says. I might need to get a pen so I can remember what. Hang on a minute. I got to get a pencil on paper. All right, so there's my pence one paper. All right, Spirit, what is it you're trying to tell us, please? And thank you very much. Make this pendulum, Spirit, go to the one, go to what you're trying to tell me about this person, okay? Go to what the main thing on this card means on this side. Thank you, Spirit, and only honest answers, please. Okay, it's about celebrity. No, celebrity. And then it's going back. Spirit, only honest answers. Hang on, let me do this. Spirit, only honest answers. Uh, put it to the one that you're it, that you're wanting to try to show us, please. Thank you. Celebrity. Okay, celebrity. What on the back? Now, Spirit, show us what you're trying to say with this right here. Old age. Celestial faith. That's what it says. Your faith was celestial. So you was... Um, hang on, let me write that down. Because I pulled out a few cards to put this to put it together. Old age. Death. That's how you died. And then celestial faith. 
and then it says celebrity, didn't it? Celebrity. All right, now let me see what this is saying. Location stars, that's what it says. Spirit, what is this card mean right here? Thank you very much. It's got death, time frame, lesson, faith, trauma. Spirit, only honest answers, please. Spinster love. Spinster love and lost si lost civilization. Spin oh, no, no. It's saying lover identity. Lover is the identity. And location is lost civilization. Lover identity. I'm not looking for another job. I'm looking for the right culture. Lost civilization. This program is brought to you in part by Sugarland Shine. Join Mark for exclusive content and more at That's weird. So this was some celebrity that died of old age. She had celestial faith, you know, the stars. She believed in things like that. And then it said her identity of her lover, the location was a lost civilization. So, like, they own their own little island. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was not many people knew of it. What are you trying to sell here, Spirit? Grandchild. Grandchild. Asia. Grandchild, Asia. No, I mean identity. Asia was the location. Grandchild is the identity. All right, hang on. Let me see what else it's saying. Hang on a second. What are you talking about over here, Spirit? Please and thank you very much. Only honest answers. Walking the middle path. Philosophical. That's what it's saying. Walking it. So philosophical is faith. And walking the mental path. Lena, you didn't choose. You just chose yourself. Oh, that's what that means. Oh, yeah. What else did this mean over here, Spirit? Hang on a second. Then we got... It says on this card, messenger, writer, scribe, publisher, communications. Put it on the one you want to speak of, Spirit. Thank you. Only honest. Only honest. You was a writer. A writer and a, publish, a publisher. A publisher of communications. Publisher of communications. I forgot to turn them over, shit. Well, never mind. I'm, I'm going to go with it. The only one I turned over was that one, I believe, okay? Never mind. I'm going to keep going, okay? I'm doing it like this. Okay. Now, what about this one down here, Spirit? Crop, star cross love, older man, late bronze days, seeing the bigger picture, war, battle. What is it? Pilgrimage. Seeing the bigger picture, lesson. Primal or Aboriginal faith. So you might have been Aboriginal. I want to read it after I'm done. Just hang on a minute. Sorry, you all. If uh, it seems like it takes forever, but I'm trying to do something for us good. Okay. I think it'll help us all. Cause you'll see what I'm doing when I'm done. Primal or Aboriginal. 
That was a faith. Alright. Look. Then it says flying monkey right here. Flying monkey, easy target, bully, tormentor, scapegoat. Let's see what that's saying. I just noticed it right there, and then I'll get that card. Which one down here? Flying monkey, bully, tormentor, easy target. Which one? Built with more pet features than any other robot, iRobot OS. Scapegoat. Go. All right, now this one right up here. Midwife, healer, faith healer, doctor, herbalist. Which one? Faith healer. Faith healer. Scapegoated this faith healer. That's fucked up, ain't it? Sorry, I didn't mean to say it. That's messed up. Excuse me, Kuwait, because sometimes I do that, and I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Okay, what's this over here? Promiscuous, other relative, age of discovery. Age of discovery. Betrayal trauma, age of discovery. Age of discovery, betrayal trauma. Time frame. And what did others say? Betrayal trauma. Trauma bond. Okay, now what about this? An agnostic, atheist, domestic abuse, sibling, classical leadership. Fire, Northern yeah, Europe. Sibling identity and classical. That's what it's doing. It's going through both of them. I'm using this shadow. So I'm getting these two. So it says identity is sibling. I love you, spirit. I love you, spirit, guides, and God, and angels, sibling identity. And what was it? Classical. I don't know what that word is, you all. Auto talks. Auto. Auto. Autologuity. What's it said? Classic antiquity. Where did that go to? Classic antiquity. Oh, that was the time frame. I don't know what that meant. I don't think. Where did it go again? Oh, I already got it. Sibling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now this and over here, what it say? This, this last one collective. Okay, only honest answer, Spirit. I love you, and I thank you so very much. And Owe has permission to copy what I do and then take it back. This is the way I do it. What are you trying to teach us, Spirit? Early modern age. Time frame, that's all that's going on. Early modern age time frame. Now we're going to mash it. We're just going to make a small batch. We're going to have rye, ball, and corn. We've got the ball and we've got corn. Okay, so let me see what I can get out of this. <laughs> okay, so they was some... Somebody out here was a celebrity. and You died of old age. and Or this is what's going to take place in the near future, you know. And you're going to die with this celestial knowledge. And that's good. That's your faith, okay? And then it says over here, you had a lover that lived, you and them, way long ago. In this uh, lost civilization, okay? Y'all 
he lived at this lost civilization and it was something to do about his identity with his grandchild like whoever this lover was it's something to do about their grandchild's identity and maybe if they actually died of old age so maybe this grandchild whoever this is about they live in asia right now they live in asia and this is about money i believe it might be gotten or something because it says her lovers this celebrity you or something like that your lover something's going to be about a grandchild and the identity and it says asia like it's a lost civilization in asia okay and this is philosophical faith well we know you know we know what that means like doing practices like this kind of or something you know what? Uh, <coughs> and walking the middle path <laughs> whatever this grandchild does she's a publisher in communications she's seeing the big picture now this was her lesson are you listening she's seeing the bigger picture too all, li all her life and the things she's learned this was a lesson they, this is about primal, primal or aboriginal faith. Back, back in the old days, okay? This was aboriginal faith. They got scapegoated by some faith healer. Are you listening? Uh, they, this was age of discovery. This was way, way long ago, okay? Like when, when faith healers... That was the age of when they first discovered it. Do you understand? And you go that way back, and they they scapegoated you. It's sad, Faith Hiller. It's it's sad. But uh, this was their primal instincts or something like for them to place all this trauma in your life and all this betrayal. It stems all the way back. This identity with siblings. It's, it still was all the way back to you and your siblings. And, and it was about betrayal. So they traumatized you with incest or something. Do you understand what that means? Or they might have got, get, they might have got uh, betrayed you in some way by telling your spouse something. Do you understand? Or they might have messed around with your partner or something. I don't know, but... Then it says time frame, classical antiquity, early modern age. So, the, whenever all this betrayal and all that shit took place, that was during the time of classical music. And, you know, when it was early modern, right before it became modern. You understand what I'm saying? So, uh, you know, back in them days... Keeping it in the family. 1818 was royalty, remember? Royalty, you know. We all talk about royalty blood. And, and if you're a celebrity, well, they kept it in the family. And uh, that's what it was. That's what it was. And it, this is something to do about a death during this age right now. Like this is in the present. Like your present time of you living, collective me and you. We're going to die of an old age because we're celestial faith. This shit's what's happened to us, and if you listen, it linked us all the way back that long ago. Did you hear how I did that? And nobody has my permission. I don't know how anybody else does this, but this is how I'm doing it, and this is mine. This is mine. This is my way, okay? I like it. So, uh, your all's faith was, is, was be, it's been tested all this time. You got identity all the way back to the lost civilizations. Do you understand this lover? You and this, you and this lover died of old. You all are going to die of old age, but you go all the way back to this lost civilization, and your all's identity was. Uh, you all had to change your location and your identity, and your grandchild it might have to come along with you to Asia. That's the location. If you have a philosophical practice of faith, 
you're walking that middle path, the in, the in between spirit realm and physical. You know how to do that. You might be uh, going to be working in publishing, communications, seeing the bigger picture. You have primordial aboriginal uh, beliefs. They scapegoated this faith healer. This trauma is linked. You discovered, you discovered at the time frame when all this shit took place, went all the way back, this betrayal with this sibling, the identity, all this shit went way back to when it was that classical, that classical uh, music age and early modern age. That's how far away long ago it goes back, this fucking trauma. Because it's a fucking brother or sister of yours. And I told y'all, y'all, if y'all watch me, y'all hear my trauma. Huh? Do you believe spirit? Does you? Does you? I do too. I love you guys. And if you're new, hit subscribe. I appreciate you. I love you. Pieces. 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 I'm trying to help you all. And me too, okay? Oh, and then on the top, look right here. And then on the top, it says witness murdered. Suicide murderer. And then it says guilty conscience. Asia. Look, Asia again. Let me see what this is saying about. Remember, it just ended with Asia. Spirit, what is this talking about? Or right above it or something. What are you talking about? Only honest. Only honest. Which one? Grandchild identity is in Asia. Are you listening? Grandchild. The identity is in Asia, and somebody might have a. That's all it's saying. Grandchild identity, but it could be trauma and guilty conscience. Somebody might have a guilty conscience. It's still about that grandchild something. Maybe if you've got a child right now, they have a baby. They feel like guilty for doing it, like like they hurt you or something. But no, no, no. What is this talking about, spirit, in a right here and now? What is this talking about? Only honest. Only honest. Poison, poison. It's landed right on that poison. Right here is poison. Look, poison. <laughs> so it, it's it landed. Look, sorry, I don't know if you see it right here. Land right back on. Like here's poison. There, here's where it landed right here. So this is about a murder. So whoever, I don't know who this is, but somebody has a guilty conscience cause they tried to murder or poison their grandchild. I don't know who that is and I wouldn't want to know, you know it. I think this goes all the way back to early modern age. This is how far this trauma goes. The last one was that betrayal with that sibling. That was in the classical time frame, okay? Now in that early modern age, this time frame, this grandchild, Somebody has a guilty conscience because they might have poisoned and murdered their grandmother or grandfather. Did you hear that? That's what it said. That's what it's saying. So that's the trauma. The trauma is the brother, the grandchild, your brother or sister. Scapegoat to this faith healer. You saw the bigger picture. You're walking the middle five path. Your faith is philosophical. Somebody, Asia grandchild identity. I think somebody's grandchild, the location is, they are in Asia. Their identity, they're in Asia, I'm telling you. And um, they're like in a lost colony, like not many people, I guess, goes there. Like they know it, do you understand? But it's talked about old age death, celebrity. Maybe they got poisoned, murder. Maybe this grandchild has a guilty conscience, like I just said, for killing this, their grandmother or grandfather. 
in their old age because they got their money, huh? Did I help Sive solve a clue? I know I did. All right. And wherever they're at, they're, they're near a volcano in Asia. There's volcanoes around. Or it might be, uh, there's going to be a, a fire or there's a forest fire going on right now. Or it might be a loud explosion. Okay, that might be what's going on right now, Collective. I don't know. But let me see if, uh, what my cards say. Spirit, spirit, is any of these going to tell us something? Three. The marriage of two results in a growth and unfoldment in three, the most imaginative and creative of numbers. Mother, father, child. The whole family. The whole family is uh, is living in, in a, like a lost place I was talking about. They're, they're, they're hoping and praying that they don't get caught for that murder and poison. Ooh, they're studying serpents. So, uh, somebody's understanding with, uh, maybe somebody's going to hear this one day and it's going to help this person in this different culture. But, uh, somebody knows who the, who the real snakes are now. That's what that's saying. Somebody, and it might be somebody you're married to. Mother, father, child. It might be... <coughs> Maybe that grandchild has a guilty conscience because she killed a mother, father, and child. She poisoned or murdered them. And I believe her grandmother or grandfather might have been a celebrity and she poisoned them too. Ain't that messed up? When you do the right thing while it's still hurting you, that's when you actually see growth in your life. Yeah, so what that's saying is, listen, little snake, if you're on my channel, since this energy pulled out, and you pulls and murdered somebody, and you're coming over here for comfort, I'll tell you right now, you better be doing the right fucking thing, because you better be listening to me. Something's going to happen to you. The devil is coming for payment. Uh-oh. Zalawancy, interpreting the appearance of fallen trees or branches. Oh, so what it's saying is, if you don't go and actually do the right thing while it's still hurting you right now, you're never going to grow. And what's going to happen is, since you're a snake, and you took these people out, whoever you are, I don't know, but whoever you are, your appearance is going to be fucked up totally because there's going to be a tree branch fall, a big ass fucking tree branch fall on you because you didn't do what spirit told you. That's messed up. I'm telling you right now, this is going to happen and that's messed up. That's messed up. Spirit, that ain't going to happen over here. I don't know who this is. Whoever this is lives in Asia. And a true man and woman in love will forgive you over and over for doing the same stuff. Now, that's true, pure, forgiving love. These people forgave her over and over <coughs> for hurting them. You younger generation needs to respect your parents a little more because they didn't have Google walking through the school's doors. No, we didn't. I got that from a, a preacher. Oh, Joyce Myers. Ichthyomancy. Is the examination of fish, living or dead? Ooh, so they saw a snake around you, examining to see if you're still alive or you're dead. And it's somebody that doesn't respect you. They're younger than you. And Atlantis is a story about a moral, spiritual people who lived in a highly advanced utopian civilization. The gods got angry because these people lost their way to greed. And they became morally bankrupt. Oh, so somebody is morally bankrupt in their life at the moment. And they're dealing with somebody shady. The Riffium are shady characters. They lived on the eastern side of the Jordan River and were defeated as the Israelites came through. They were also associated with various gigantic warriors. Then it gets odd. 
the Rephim is used in many of the Old Testament's poetic books for the inhabitants of the shady netherworld beyond the grave, Job 26, 5. So somebody's uh, somebody is linked to uh, Atlantis. And uh, back way long ago, you all helped to get across the eastern side of the Jordan River. You all helped position logs and made a bridge to so you they could pass through. Did you hear that? I love you, Spirit. Now, I don't remember how it went, so you better remember how I said it. What else did it say, Spirit? Four or more people has their eyes on you. Four or more people has their eyes on you to see if you really are true and you give pure love. Well, I do. And elephants have a great memory. When one dies, the other elephant mourns their loss, and this can last for days. Yeah, it's sad how poor little elephants do that. But you've, you've had to mourn four or more people. Yeah. You know, in a short amount of time. And that's tough on any marriage. Did you all know that? It is. Well, you both love the same people. Let me all, let me teach y'all some learning lessons in our life. That fucking morning when you die, when, when a child of yours dies, collective, that shit never goes away. It never. And people will say, and with time, it gets easier. No, it don't. No, it don't. With time, you just, you're able to, you know, tolerate it without bursting out into a cry or whatever. You, you just learned how to keep those feelings under control. Some people may say, I'm cold. I'm not. Uh, I used to be the funniest person you'll ever meet in your life until my stepson passed away. And, you know, I mean, to each their own. Either they believe you or don't, you know. But, but anyway, some, it says macromancy by swords, daggers, and knives. There's four or more people right now trying to stab an elephant. Fuck you, whoever you are. Did you see that? These four more people want to take knives and throw into you so your memory, you'll never think of your loved ones again. Well, you can't. You can't. You're all, you all uh, followed me, you fucking enemies from prehistoric times when we was back long ago. Uh, it's funny, and I, and I know, I know something about that. I know something about cavemen. It's my name in one of them they found not long ago. It's like the last one they found, and it said Denny Vaughn, V-O-N. D-E-N-N-I-V-O-N. What do you think about that, Collective? <laughs> it's real funny, ain't it? Some of you know. What else? What else? Oh, that's how you know it's true for me. Oh, Deflomancy. Study the movement and shape of the clouds. Oh, and then we got pyramids. And then we got Ecclesiastes 3.11. He has made everything beautiful in its time. And it came right under Job 26.5. Talking about the only shady characters in the Bible. Four more people. To live is to suffer. To die is to be born again and to end suffering. I believe that's what it meant to say. Or it's to be born again and to suffer. Okay, what else? One more. Spirit. Spirit. Here we have a one on lower. Ooh, Spirit said no worse too. He said, people that makes jokes and make fun of you only get mad and angry for the simple fact that you're smart and they aren't. Ooh, that's just a funny. People don't like it. You said that. Well, I want talking to you in general, people. If you're my collective, y'all got to remember, I don't even know who most of y'all are. Do you understand that? I just make fun. I just try to make make uh, a little joke sometimes. But remember, four or more people, and then four came out again. 
Somebody needs some nourishment right now. And, and they're doing, uh, they need to do something practical or they're doing something practically every day. They need to be cautious and reliable. The salt of the earth. It suggests solid foundations and perimeters that contain and protect. So all it's saying is you're like a mommy elephant. You and your man are true love and you have forgave and you love each other. And these people wants to burn your love. Well, I don't give a fuck. Get on my channel. Why are you still on here? Do y'all think that I'm suffering? Because we've, we've lived suffering. Do you, do you not get that? I, ha I have suffered my whole life. Do you, do you get it? Who, who else gets it? All right, well, me and my partner, our dumb ISIS wanted to come back to this day and age for some reason. It's my life's life. I'm good with myself. I done ask God for forgiveness. He give it to me. <laughs> so I'm good. I'm good with myself collective. I don't have nothing to worry about. Oh, but somebody feels like a jackass for making you hurt over what they said about you, Collective. Oh, that's sad, ain't it? They feel like he's sad. Well, jackass. Keep going, don't stop. Star child. Keep going, don't stop. And then we have all the Omotsi, and this is by observing the shapes formed by dropping egg whites into water. Nobody has my permission to copy. This is how people back in the old days, they studied things. They used to study snakes. They actually did it. They still do it this day. They still do it this way in different places across the world. They'll boil water. They'll crack an egg, let the egg whites go in the water, and they'll tell you fortune. Yeah. See, I'm a star child. I'm giving great nourishment. And I know I am. That's why you need to hit, su hit subscribe. Because who else tells you that good shit? Nobody. Nobody. I told you a great place life reading. Just then I did. Here, let me tell y'all something else. What's one of these collecting these? You know. It's sad. Gold. You don't need someone else to fix you. Fullness, give thanks, which justice is coming. Feast, slow down and celebrate yourself. Ooh. So, uh, you know that you didn't need anybody else to fix you. You feel full with yourself. And I say thank you, spirit guides and angels and everybody that helps me. I appreciate you. Justice is coming for us, ladies. Don't you worry. Slow down and celebrate yourself, star child. Red and forgive. Forgive yourself for all your wrongs and all the wrongs that people done to you. I forgive. I forgive, Spirit. I hope you help us. And then it said, confidence. It comes with time and practice to become full. Yes, that's true. And I've told you all this, so believe it, kids. Don't get mad. It's true. It's nothing to get mad about. And one day you'll have all that wisdom and you'll be able to let it shine. You need to do something that makes you feel confident, something you're good at at your age. Do you understand? And, and no, I am always enough, White House. Don't doubt your worth. Don't doubt your worth because uh, if some witch did something to you, you're getting ready to celebrate over her. You're going to have a victory. Don't you worry. And then it said, territorial, you're slowing down. You're finding your place. You're finding your place at the moment. You're forgiving, and you're looking through with fresh eyes. You're like, I gotta re relook at this situation of how I want to look on my throne, and that's what you're doing. And you're seeing how beautiful you are, and you still got roses and plants growing all around you. You're growing. You're growing full, like that big old fat cat. I see, like that big old fat cat. You need to water your plants good. Go get you something good to drink. It's stars. You can manifest your every wish. See? See? That's why. And we can. You're bringing it from from as above, so below. And and a somebody around you, star, want to instigate. They're like, psh, 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 and you're like, hey, entitlement. Check your prima donna. You're like, you're not going to be able to slap me off of my throne. No. I'm sitting on my throne comfortably. I slow down and I celebrate myself. Huh? 
They're getting mad because I ain't been putting out many readings. Well, because I want my channel to grow. I'm a star. That's the only way it'll grow. I have to quit. I teach it. You all a lesson. <laughs> Conundrum. Up in the air. See, they want you to be up in the air. Like, which way do I go, George? Which way? I'm crazy. I'm losing my mind now. Uh -uh. You're not up in the air. You're not in a conundrum. But they are. They sure the hell caught their self in a conundrum. Uh -uh. They got their self stuck in some shit they wish they hadn't got in. That's the truth, and I let it show, and I, and I tell it. I'm a star that shows you, and I tell you. And I prove it in real time, and that's why y'all know I'm true. That's why. One more. One more says... Bitch fire. Stand up for yourself. That's the truth. See, you had to stand up for yourself. So, so release all this guilt of feeling guilty because you had to tell the truth about something. And it might have hurt. It might have hurt another star, but they was doing bitch fire to you. And you had to stand up for yourself. So release the guilt. It's okay. And bury that grudge. Don't care. I bury. I bury. I, I'm not bitch fire anymore. Thank you, Spirit. I love you. See these? I ain't did these in a while. What something else up? We need to know, Spirit Guides. Ooh, volcano. Remember earlier, volcano, I told you? There's a volcano. And these people, this people in Asia, that woman that had caused that, that did that murder, and she's feeling guilty. She don't understand. She's getting ready to cause a, a, a volcano explosion to erupt for getting this damn predicament going. And she's some kind of witch or something. And, she, and she's, she's some kind of witch. And what she don't understand, what the dumb ice is manifesting, where she manifests her star grandparent to die, remember? Where she manifests her star grandparent to die. And they did. Spirit's going to kill that world. I hate to say it. She's going to be up in the air and that volcano still going to get her. Yep. She feels like she's about to explode. Whoever it is that just got found out. Minimal, indulgent, lavish. She lives a lavish, indulgent lifestyle. She's right now, uh, right now it's been a mystery because they couldn't find this person. See how truth sounds like with her true tarot reader? Listen. Uh, and, and this old uh, woman, she's been slothing and being lazy. She's been in a mirage. Very bitch she is. And um, she's been, been living over the top and doing everything over the top. Might be stealing off the online. Uh, somebody might have did that to my bank account. Yeah, she's been hesitant and indecisive of what to do. Yeah, she's scared. She knows she's going to go to jail. You know that cliffs. Look, and it's upside down. She's thinking about jumping off a cliff. She's very anxious at the moment and on edge. I'd say so. She carries grudges with everybody and, and uh, she killed people. Whoever it is, I don't know. Don't take it personal if it ain't you. Whoever's watching my channel, it ain't you. But it's for somebody one day. Because I'm supposed to reach all around the world. And this is about Aura Borellis. Unique. Limited, rare. This woman ain't never seen somebody so unique and radiant and rare whenever she realizes she's getting ready to be called up and go to jail when she realizes I did this reading. Oh, and, and, and uh, you're somebody that's limited and rare and, and you feel satisfied with yourself, okay? And gentle. You have a deep and profound... Uh, a complex being, whoever this good person is that's letting all this out. 
you use your logic you're pragmatic and sensible and and that is what a, i'm aquarius and we are logical and you're bias and people respect you and people respect me so bias and that means aquarius did you get it i get it i love you god what else what else oh what did it say rainforest somebody is confused though uh they uh they feel troubled around you You've been thinking about this logically in your environment. You've been thinking about this in your environment. Maybe uh, it's person. You're you've been uh, a group. A group tried to confuse you, you logical person. They tried to change your profound love in your environment. These motherfuckers. Spirit, can we have one? Not 12. Sleek, black, suave, alluring, charming. Somebody is confused in this group. It's the one that's very alluring to you. That's how you know who it is. Oh, they're wondering if I should bring you a ring. <laughs> They've been watching you. Never mind about all that underneath. This is in a present moment. Somebody wants to explode. Somebody's up in the air. They're getting ready to explode because they're living too lavishly and indulgently. That's an illusion. You need to relax and be reserved and lazy and don't go over the top and, 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 and being indecisive. Or anxious because you're very unique and rare and soft and easy and gentle and a profound, you have a profound being and you're very pragmatic and sensible and you got to stop feeling confused and up in your head over a ring it looks like with this group or being hesitant to go speak your mind about this group. Because grace is going to be shed upon you in this calmness. You're, you're, you've you learned to let grace shed upon you. and You've been forgiving yourself and using your logic mind. Verified blue, that's the truth. <laughs> oh, and popular, attractive, favorable. Oh, and blue is Aquarius' uh, color. So, uh, you're very calm and graceful and... You're certified checkmate. You are fucking a chess queen checkmate. And you're very popular. You're becoming popular checkmate. Oh, and it's something about eclipse. Oh, this next, this next eclipse, you're getting ready to be a person of influence. They overshadowed you for a while. But you're getting ready to show them your checkmate verified. Bye-bye. Uh, excuse me. It, it's truth, and they've been sniffing this out that they, that you're going to be at. That's why they pay attention every time you're active and online. These motherfuckers, they know you're beautiful, purple amethyst, Aquarius, and and uh, what's that about? You know how to use your intuition, and they're like, wow, wow, mom. Oh, wow, wow. This mom is fucking so intuitive and smart. I don't know if we were to fuck with her. She's so resourceful and innovative and creative. They're stealing them all. They're, they're making this decision to take little sharp, quick jabs and steal from you. And wow, wow, wow. And what's going to happen is... They're, 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 you better wish it. You better stop fuck with me, you motherfuckers, whoever you are. Here's what I say. You're getting ready to be in a conundrum. Now, if you ain't doing nothing to me, I didn't do it to you. I do it to somebody that does it to me. I read the fucking cards for the collective. Understand, collective? I love y'all. What about a fucking decision to quit? Hang on with it. Fucking babble. Gossip, scandal, rumors. Yeah. Yeah, uh, oh, of course, was fucking smart. She made the decision to get the fuck away from this scandal, fucking gossip group, rumor ice. You're somebody who's a com, com uh, you're accommodating and flexible. But they're watching you online like a fucking hawk, these baboons. These, these enemies and frenemies. 
They're like, OMG, what the hell did she say? She's going to win. Then they're going to be like an alligator. Rawr, rawr, rawr. You can't have that. You're about, fuck you, what? It's whatever. They're very... They're getting ready to threaten you online. Somebody's going to threaten you and me collective online. And, uh... What did it say about... Fuck, I can't breathe collective. I'll be dusting. I will have to go outside a minute. Dial up. See? They're, they're still in your internet. In your environment. See environment at the top. They think it's funny. Yes. But I just revealed that these are opportunists. And uh, they're open to, for anything. Fuck you piece of shits. Mac and cheese. Oh, they want to be a little sappy. And you're like, nah, we don't want to hear no sappy bullshit. Whoever it is, you're like, nah. Turtle said, you go with the flow. You just go with the flow. You're not being cheesy and sentimental and bullshit or less. <laughs> you don't need nobody to validate or approve your fucking, the way you're supposed to go with the flow. You don't need nobody to confirm or validate nothing. No, I don't. I don't, spirit guys. I love you. And you're like, what's the big deal, pickle? Ha <laughs> ha. My saying, what's the big deal, pickle? That's what you say. And uh, like says to the hourglass, these are the days of our lives. That's what it said. Somebody wants to stick a pickle in you. They they're running all the time. I don't I don't need that confirmed. Do you collective? I'm not worried about when the dick gets confirmed into your cooch or no. I'm not. Oh, but somebody's getting ready to. She is a waterfall. <laughs> it's funny. It ain't what it said, but it fun. It fucking looked like it. Look, pickle in a hoo ha, hoo hoo, <laughs> waterfall, hoo hoo. They're trying to put you in a bind. They's like, watch me win. We think she's a little bitty pussy. No, you ain't, motherfucker. I, I've been slowly, gradually growing, and uh, abundance and a lavish is coming to me. Thank you for that. Uh, thank you for that. And somebody, maybe in my collective, okay? It will collective. You got to keep growing and growing. All right. Well, please like, subscribe, and share. And I love you guys. And that's all I got. I can't breathe. I got to get off here. And my nose is hurting, and I don't want to hear no more of this about a thief and whoever lazy is spying on us. All right. All right. Well, peace. Y'all have a good evening.